Hey, thanks again for stopping through Terrence McCall's Channel T Entertainment. This is Channel T Sports. I'm bringing you part two of my week 16 predictions. Um, this the segment I'm going to be breaking down my week 15 prediction recaps as well. Um, make sure you like and subscribe to my page and leave a comment um, and let me know what your favorite sports team is and who you like going into the playoffs and who you think is going to win the Super Bowl. All right, so for week 15, I had the Raiders beating the Chargers 28 to 26. The Chargers win 30 to 27. For my Saturday games, I had the Bills 31 to 14 over the Broncos. The Bills win 48 to 19. I had the Panthers losing to the Packers 36 to 10. The Packers Win 24-16. I had the Texans losing to the Colts 33-17. The Colts win 27-20. I had the Titans over the Lions 36-16. And the Titans win 46-25. The Bears was going to win 21-20. I'm sorry. According to my pick but they end up winning over the Vikings 33 to 27 uh for my upset special it almost happened it almost happened uh this game went down to the last seconds um Haskins uh he played a, he did a good game but man um after uh the game though know, he got into some personal issues um and he got stripped of his captaincy, but I'm not going to talk any more about that. Um, moving on down to the Patriots, I had the Dolphins over the Patriots, twenty nine to twenty. The Dolphins pull it off by ten. Uh, I had the Ravens winning thirty one to twenty over the Jaguars. The Ravens winning forty to fourteen. I had the Buccaneers twenty seven twenty one over the Falcons. The Buccaneers win thirty one twenty seven. I had the Cowboys over the 49ers, 19-16. The Cowboys win in a shootout, 41-33. I had the Eagles losing to the Cardinals, 29-10. The Cardinals win 33-26. And I had my Rams beating the Jets, 33-30. But uh, the Jets played a hell of a game um, defensively-wise. Um, they stopped Jared Goff. that made my boy look like a goof. Um, but... That's still my quarterback. That's still my team, man. And they will win uh, next week. But anyway, they uh, did come back and they put on the fight. But there was some questionable play calling um, at the end of the game. Um, anyway, moving down, the Chiefs was going to win 35-30. to But they put up 32 points to the Saints 29. I had the Browns winning. 30 to 27 over the Giants. The Browns win 20 to 6. I had the Monday night game. The Steelers was going to bounce back 38 to 17 over the Bengals, but that was a upset. The Bengals win 27 to 17 and had the Steelers their third consecutive loss. Okay, on to week 16. Um, these are the games I made on my video yesterday. Um, Make sure uh, that you look at these if you want um, on my last video. That would be uh, highly appreciate. But anyways, I'm moving on down. I have the Ravens over the Giants, 39 to 10. I have the Chiefs beating the Falcons, 36 to 17. I have the Browns winning 35-17 over the Jets. I have the Bears winning 27 to 10 over the Jaguars. I have the Bengals by three over the Texans. I have the Colts. Losing to the Steelers 23-20. to If the Steelers win, they can wrap up that division. Um, I have the Washington, D.C. football team 27-13 over the Panthers. I have the Chargers losing to the Broncos by one point, 29-28. I have the Eagles 26-20 over the Cowboys. My Rams will bounce back and beat the Seahawks uh, for a second time this season and sweep them 28-28. To 25 would be the score. And I have the Titans losing to the Packers by one point, 30 to 29. And I have the Bills 27 to 20 over the Patriots. All right, all right, all right. So I'm going to break down my top five performances of week 15. At 
Number five is going to be the Jets defense. Man, that defense ate my boy golf up. Um, but the Rams did fight back at the last uh, quarter. Um, they made a triumphant comeback. Um, I was proud of them, but they made some questionable play calls. Um, towards the end of the game, um, you could blame Mave, you could blame everybody on that team for giving the Jets uh, their their first win of the season. And uh, really, if you ask me, that was a game that we needed um, to push us forward to the playoffs. Uh, we might have could have clinched the playoffs, you know, already if we would have beat the Jets. But the Jets, uh, they wanted that game more than the Rams did, obviously. But the Rams are still my team. Uh, at number four, uh, the quarterback from Cincinnati, uh, family, he did good. He just only had seven for 13 yards. Well, no, I'm sorry, seven for 13 attempts. Um, four, 89 yards uh, and one touchdown. He also had 10 carries for 43 yards and one touchdown uh, at Number three, my boy Haskins. Um, uh, I don't know what else to say about him. Um, he went to the strip club uh, without a mask, uh, got fined, and he lost his leadership skills uh, for the team. But I don't know what they're going to do with him. He might not be with the team next year. Uh, I don't know, man. Uh, you just have to be careful, but... Um, I'm not going to be talking about them and be talking about more on my video. Uh, really, it's not about uh, talking about other players. It's just about doing predictions and doing my top five performances. But anyway, uh, he did 38 for 55 uh, for 295 yards, one touchdown and two interceptions. And at number two, uh, Anthony Brown and Donovan Wilson for the Dallas Cowboys. Uh Anthony Brown had four tackles and one interception, and Donovan Wilson had six tackles, one interception. At number one, my boy Derrick Henry for the Titans. Um, he might be the MVP for Channel T. Um, he been like the t one of my top players for a couple of weeks, um, heading on into this season uh, for 24 carries. 147 yards for one touchdown. Um, I would like for you all to make sure you like and subscribe to my page at Terrence McCall's Channel T Entertainment at YouTube. You can also find me at Terrence McCall at Facebook. And make sure you follow me at TerrenceMax79 at Instagram. Um, I would like to hear from you all. Um, don't be shy. Uh, let me know who your team is going to be in the playoffs and who you think is going to win in the Super Bowl. Do you think your team can make it to the uh, Super Bowl? I'd like to see it. I think my Rams can make it, but uh, the offense is going to have to keep going. They're going to have to keep uh, keep going, keep consistent. Get their head out their asses uh, and start right now because we have two more games against the Western uh, foe as – the Seattle Seahawks and the Arizona Cardinals. Um, these are two of the important games. Um, and it seemed like every season we play one or uh, other team at the last uh, game of the season or the last two game of the season. It never fails. Um, but anyway, uh, I wish you all a very, very good night. Um, I hope y'all had a blessed Christmas. Um, Let's focus on the new year, 21. Y'all have a good night. Thank you.